हेलो एवरीवन नमस्कार सो लेट सॉल्व वन मोर क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम द कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ इंटीग्रल कैलकुलस दिस इज अ डबल इंटीग्रल प्रॉब्लम एंड इट अपीयर्ड इन गेट सी एस सी सो इजी प्रॉब्लम इजी लुकिंग प्रॉब्लम लेट सी वेदर इट इज लेंथी और नॉट अदरवाइज इट इज लुकिंग इजी सो एज यू कैन सी the uh, i am first talking about the inner integral because the limits are in terms of x so this will obviously be the limits of y and the outer integral 0 to 1 is the limit of x so first we'll solve with respect to y okay so what we'll do 0 to 1 you can also take x outside if you want uh, x uh, and dx outside but uh, yes If you want, you can take. Otherwise, let's take x and dx outside. Okay. And this is from x to one upon x, one upon one plus y square. If x would have been there, you would have treated uh, that as constant. Constant के अंदर treat करते हैं उसको. फिर भी कोई दिक्कत नहीं होता. Uh, यहाँ पे dy हो जाएगा. ठीक है तो अब क्या हो जाएगा बाहर वाला इंटीग्रल तो ऐसे ही रहेगा फिलहाल पहले अंदर वाले पे फोकस करते हैं अंदर वाले इंटीग्रल पे आ जाते हैं वन अपॉन वन प्लस वाई स्क्वायर का इंटीग्रेशन हमारे पास टेन इनवर्स वाई हो जाएगा फ्रॉम एक्स टू वन अपॉन एक्स ठीक है तो हमारे पास क्या आ गया जीरो टू वन एक्स डी और इसमें पुट करें तो टेन इनवर्स वन अपॉन एक्स माइनस लोअर लिमिट तो टेन इनवर्स एक्स अब टेन इनवर्स वन अपॉन एक्स को आप कॉट इनवर्स एक्स भी लिख सकते हैं माइनस टेन इनवर्स एक्स इंटू एक्स डी एक्स Now, depending on what you want, you can change one cot in terms of tan or tan in terms of cot by using the uh, formula that the cot inverse x plus tan inverse x is pi by two. So I can write cot in terms cot inverse in terms of tan. So cot inverse x can be written as pi by two minus tan inverse x. And one more tan inverse x is there. x dx so this is 0 to 1 pi by 2 minus 2 tan inverse x we can use integration by part uh, treating this as the first function treating this as the second function first function as it is so first function that means pi by 2 into integration of x which is x square by 2 minus integration of derivative of first so derivative of pi by 2 minus 2 tan inverse x will be derivative of pi by 2 will be 0 derivative of this minus 2 tan inverse x will be minus 2 Derivative of tan inverse x is one upon one plus x square. We have done into integration of x, which is x square by two, and whole integration. Now, as you can see, two and two gets cancelled. Uh, this uh, minus minus becomes plus. Okay, so this is from zero to one. Then uh, you have plus x square divided by one plus x square, so you can write that as x square plus one minus one. So x square plus one divided by x square plus one, and that minus one 
divided by 1 plus x square. You can write like this also. Okay. Goes from 0 to 1. So pi by 2 minus 2 tan inverse x integration of 1 this will be integration of 1 which will give you uh, x and integration of this will give you tan inverse x now start putting values so when you will put 1 so here orally I am solving when you will put 1 so this will become tan inverse 1 which is pi by 4 2 into pi by 4 is pi by 2 pi by 2 minus pi by 2 is 0 so this term entire this bracket is becoming 0 so the entire first term becomes 0 and when you will put 1 here so it will become 1 minus tan inverse 1 that is pi by 4 now when you will put the lower limit first term is obviously becoming 0 because of this x coming to second term because of this x it is becoming 0 and because tan inverse 0 is 0 so again in lower limit all the terms are 0 so this is your final answer 1 minus tan inverse uh, 1 minus pi by 4 uh, you can uh, if uh, this is an integer based uh, question or it's a numerical type question if it is so the value of pi is uh, 3.14 and uh, you can do one thing you can take LCM so this become 4 minus 3.14 divided by 4 so this is 0 0.86 divided by 4 approximately uh, you can take the values as 0 0.215 okay approximately so near around you can give the answer final answer was this okay so I hope you understood this again it was not as difficult as double integral is considered just solve one integral at a time okay first integral was in terms of y the inner one which I am talking about and uh, whatever result came we then post it to the outer integral so final answer our pass 1 minus pi by 4 again ठीक आसान था ऐसे और क्वेश्चंस के लिए हमारे प्लेलिस्ट को देखें चैनल को सब्सक्राइब करें बहुत बहुत धन्यवाद